Hi, I'm Valentina from Spotter Home. I'm about to show you a beautiful one-bedroom apartment situated on the second floor in the heart of Prenzlauer Berg. Your closest connection here is about a 10-minute walk away or slightly under. It's at Prenzlauer Allee, which is on the Ringbahn, the circular line that takes you around the circumference of Berlin. Also, um, equally the same distance is Schönhauser Allee station, which is a very popular station. You're centrally connected via the S9 and other S-Bahn lines, as well as the U2 line, which uh, is a quite popular line to use. Also, you've got a supermarket quite close by and a street filled with shops that you may need just around the corner. So you've got everything in your closest vicinity here. Let's start with the tour. So you walk in. And in front of you is the bedroom. On your left, a seating area in this longer hallway. And then there's a storage cupboard on the right hand side, followed by the bathroom, straight ahead the kitchen. And on the other side of the left, so right next to the bedroom, is the living room. What's great about this flat is that it also has a balcony. I'll start by showing you the bathroom. So the bathroom has a small mirror above the sink and a cupboard underneath the sink. You've got a towel hanger system here and space to store some toiletries in this hanging shelf. You've also got a free floating shelf with plenty of towels. Your toilet at the end of the bathroom and a bathtub. You've got your shower head connected to the shower and a handle to get out of the bath easier. I really love the kitchen in this apartment. It's very well thought through and a lot has been done to make the most of the space available in terms of worktop space. So here you've got your fridge, above it a microwave, a wine rack, um, a small cupboard with little drawers on it to store some smaller things. In these free-floating shelves, you've got glasses of all kinds, teas, coffee, presses and espresso makers, chopping boards, a toaster, a kettle, and everything that you need, including cutlery. So this kitchen comes fully equipped. Also here you've got your top loader, washing machine, and this also comes down. This bit of wood which uh, connects to the worktop, so you've got a lot of surface here, and your oven, as well as electric hob. Small shelf with some herbs, and here mugs, plates, bowls, cups. Just above your sink with the really lovely tiles in the background. And here you've got a seating area that can also function as a dining area with two wooden chairs and a small lamp as well as a radio. You've also got a really nice view into the courtyard behind the building here and a small pantry cupboard here as well as at the top. In the hallway, you've got this small storage cupboard with a hoover in it, an iron, and hoover bags as well as connectors for the hoover as well as your electric box. A free-floating shelf, a wooden chair. Here you've got your speaker answering phone and a very safe door with an additional lock. And here are your shoe rack and vintage cloak rail shelving system and a chest with two cushions on it that can function as a seat as well as a full-length mirror. Next up is the bedroom just across the entrance. This is a very spacious and bright room. Behind the door you've got a wardrobe made of wood, additional bedding and blankets and pillows up there. Here in the corner, a chest of drawers with additional bedding at the top. A very lovely looking sturdy bed that is actually quite wide. And here on either side, you've got a small table that functions as a nightstand. And in the corner, you've got a reading lamp. Here, 
you've got a smaller table, a laundry hamper, a desk with a wooden chair, and a chest of drawers with three drawers and a comfortable looking armchair made of leather. From here you've got the same view as the balcony onto the quiet street next door. And last but not least, the living room. It's a beautiful space with a very large, comfortable, as well as luxurious looking leather sofa with a metal base that seats up to four or five people. It's got plenty of pillows, so it can also function as a lounger. And over here, you've got a sideboard with two speakers and another radio or music amplifier system. You've got a round table here with four vintage chairs around it, plenty of other cushions, and over here, a bookshelf with a small light on it. And here, the balcony with a seating area. Um, it's a wooden table with two wooden chairs and the view onto the quiet street again. Thanks so much for joining me today. I really hope you enjoyed the tour of this beautiful one-bedroom flat in Prenzlauer Berg. If you've got any questions, please don't hesitate to get in touch via spotofum.com. We look forward to hearing from you. Auf Wiedersehen.